He has really come on, shooting a career high, 36% from beyond the arc on the season. JJ is a good matchup for Zion, by the way. Consequently, since Zion's come back, they've turned it over the most of anybody in the NBA. They're 30th in the NBA in turnover percentage, Dave, over the last 15 games. That one, but nearly 46% from downtown his last 14 games. JJ's going to get the benefit of a whistle here. JJ. Timberwolves come up with the offensive board. JJ with the threes. How about that? Four point possession for Minnesota. That'll get you right back in the game. It's a three point game. See, from downtown. And his final year at Duke. His one year at Duke, I should say, which was the best by any freshman ever in Duke history in terms of percentage. <laughs> oh, man. JJ's done some great things in this game. He's got nine points. No. Gets his own miss, though. Credit Josh Okogie for keeping that one alive. You think it's his? I think right now it's the, he's the odds on favorite as James Johnson gets that one to go. Picking up where he left off in the first half, coming into the game, being productive. Back to Johnson. Great pass by Jared Culver. This last few ball games, he's done a lot of nice things. Have gone. Not a three straight games with single digit makes until tonight. And man, Malik Beasley. Johnson. Deep. Oh, man. I feel like he might have put his hand on the ball again. He'd done that before. Beasley for Johnson. Extra pass. Russell for three. Russell. There's JJ. He's talked about Nas playing well. JJ comes right into the game. Okogi. Man, Josh Okogi. Dave, how good has he been? Got a finger on that one. And now Aaron Gomez the other way for the dunk. Five points, 12 assists, 10 rebounds. Johnson 